African reggae vibe is different and unique because of the incorporation of African rhythm and chants. From the 1970s onward, African reggae music has been blazing throughout the continent with some even having a considerable impact on the world stage. Today, we are looking at the 10 greatest African reggae songs of all time, as perceived by Hovering Africa. Under pressure we will, under pressure, under pressure black people, under pressure, under pressure Nigerians, under pressure. Under Pressure by Raski Monu is a number 10. This song talks about the pressure the challenges of life exert on people. It is a song that many people, especially the lower class, can well relate to. In fact, at any point in time that you feel pressure, this Raski Monu tune comes to mind. Some are cry, some are die, some are weeping, some are wailing, everywhere. Raskimono's style is unique. Reggae originates from the Caribbean, but you still feel the African in the voice of Raskimono. No wonder this hit song is so easy to memorize and remember. Without any doubt, Eddie Edna Ogoli is the queen of African reggae and she comes at number 9 with Obaru. She usually sings in Isoko, one of the native languages in Nigeria. This song encourages all to always move forward in whatever they do. Ubaru has the reggae feel, but you can also feel the traditional vibes in the instrumentation of this great song by Evie Edna Ogoli. <laughs> We have Mama Africa by Black Prophet at number 8. Black Prophet may not be a household name in Africa, but he surely does churn out some fantastic reggae tunes. Mama Africa by Black Prophet is an example of a classic reggae tune. But nowadays those moves have been paralyzed by the church in act of Babylon In this song, he laments about challenges such as climate change and increased immorality faced by Africa. Despite these challenges, he says that Mama Africa is still the prettiest. Really, really, really and truly. Mama Africa, you are the prettiest. Still Searching by Bongos Iku and the Groovies is an African classic that is so popular throughout the continent. It's a standard lovers rock tune that is still getting airplay on radio stations after more than 40 years of its release. When I've been searching for the song is a song of hope for people who are searching for their true love out there. Never give up on your quest for true love. This song helped the album to sell over 1 million copies, making it a bankable tune for the record label Emmy Nigeria. 
Nothing good comes easy. This I know. And just remember, the title is still searching and not searching for true love, as it is commonly mistaken out there. Mighty hard to find true love. Well, 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 <laughs> we have another vintage classic, Cloud 7 from Nigeria with beautiful woman. Well, I know what I did to you was wrong. Please, darling, forgive me. This song just never dies. It has endured through the years. The vocal harmony of this song reminds us of Bob Marley and the Wailers. This song is appealing to a lost love to return. The song is so melodious and soothing that we forget it is a broken heart song. Beautiful Woman is really a classic tune that defines an era. At number 5 is Usuzi by Slaves, a group formed by Lucky Dubé and named after his 1987 album Slave. This song in Zulu laments on the problems of this world. The lead singer, Tutukani Sele, has a very well-toned voice that keeps your attention even if you don't understand the language. The chorus is very typical of a traditional South African song. A reggae sound with unapologetic African elements that warms our hearts. Lucky Dubé is bound to certainly appear on this list. He comes at number 4 with his 1987 classic song, Slave. Common misconception out there is that this song is about one being a slave to his fellow human. Others think it evokes memories of the Atlantic slave trade. Not at all. The song is about overdependence on alcohol. In the song, Lucky Dube sings out a person's desperation to fight and conquer alcoholism. If you listen carefully, you can hear him saying in the chorus, I am a liquor slave. Now we come to probably another song that might not be all that popular in Africa Burning Desire. Hola. So many nights. Have I sang till my heart sings no more? Just to see the burning desire. Oh, the vocal delivery of Uta, a Hausa word meaning fire, really provides warmth and calm to the heart. The Ghanaian duo sings about the everyday hassle of life and their burning desire for the next generation to experience a better life. Imagine even on the street Waking up with nothing to eat We keep paying taxes We keep building mansions If you have never heard this tune Pay attention to it again And appreciate the bubbling talents in Africa So many nights Have I sung Till my heart sings no more Just to see 
African Reggae Fever by international renowned artist Rocky Downey comes at number two. African Reggae Fever, catch it, catch it. There will be no cure when you get it. Hey, you Mr. DJ, play it, spread it. It is the common man. This song is a celebration of the reggae music genre. Getting hit by reggae music is incurable. It stays with you whether young or old. This song is crafted to lift up your mood when you hear it. The beat is danceable and the chorus is an easy sing along. The number one African reggae song of all time goes to Alpha Blondie, a man of many languages. With Kokodi Rock, we have a song that makes reference to the township of Kokodi Rock in Cote d'Ivoire. Interesting trivia is that the song was backed by Bob Marley's backing group, The Wailers. This song is surely Afra Blondie's signature tune, and also a true signature tune in reggae music, not only in Africa, but also the world. Thank you very much for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to keep the channel growing. Press the like button and please feel free to comment on the list.